The Department of Defense is one family of many faiths. As a Muslim who's defended our country as a veteran, it's heartbreaking when some of your fellow citizens question your loyalty. People seeing us as traitors and not believe that we could be loyal to the United States. Many who haven't served, who are in political positions, want to take away our rights as Americans just because we're Muslim. Right now, there are thousands of Muslim American soldiers, sailors, Marines, and airmen serving and defending all of us. Hi, I'm Staff Sergeant Aleem Shabazz. This is Lieutenant Commander Mahmoud Ahmad. Hello, I'm Specialist Sharif Rashid. I'm PFC Shacker from Kuwait. Specialist Husseini from 182FA, Dragon Battalion. Protecting our great uh, country. We will go die for other people that aren't Americans to support their rights of freedom. But yet, when I come home, political leaders, they talk about following people, tapping their phone calls, putting police in, you know, Muslim majority neighborhoods. For me, that's, that's crazy. I'm a veteran, I, I serve for this country, and you're gonna tell me that my family can't come over from the Middle East to visit me? You're gonna ban them because they're Muslim? But didn't I fight for their right to be Muslim in this country? I feel we've gone to a point as Americans, that there's no returning, and we need to stop it, or else we, I think we've almost lost our soul. I know what we were able to accomplish together in the military. If our own men and women in our armed forces that are there fighting on a daily basis are able to look past the divide based on race and religion, why can't we, who aren't fighting every day of our lives, do the same thing?